Rias, a fun but repetitive challenge. Rias is a strategy math puzzle god game where you control four different giants. Forest, Earth, Ocean, and Swamp. Each giant has its own special abilities, but they all interact with each other while world building. The concept is simple. You need to bring life to the planet. You start with either an ocean or a desert. Ocean allows you to create a forest or a swamp. And then you need to place life in the form of either animals or food. Once you do this, people will settle and build a village. They'll start a project which tells you the minerals they need. And it's up to you to bounce a small space to ensure you can provide enough materials for the village to strive. And you can manage as many as you'd like. But again, you only get four giants for the entire world. And their abilities have cooldowns, so juggling will definitely take skill. As you complete projects, you will earn an unlock for an ability for one of the four giants. This is where the strategy ultimately comes into play, especially trying to unlock skills around the type of environment you want to build on. And each project gets increasingly harder, causing you to have to mix and match different character abilities to add wealth to an animal, for example, and strategically place plants, animals, and minerals to boost the stats of surrounding materials. And at first you only get 30 minutes to play around with your world and complete challenges that eventually unlock the 1 hour and 2 hour long modes. You can knock out challenges one playthrough at a time, or you can tackle them all at once. But if you do go for a juggling act, you have to be careful, as settlements that grow too fast get greedy. The more you provide, the more projects you complete, the less the villagers are impressed by you. They'll start attacking other villages and this is where you have to step in. If a settlement gets too out of hand, you have the power to crush them to burn them, add danger to humble them, or drown them. Unfortunately though, while I definitely found my first few hours to be very enjoyable, the game doesn't ever really throw in new hurdles for you to deal with. So the gameplay ultimately starts to feel slow and frustrating at times trying to get the math right to allow an area to prosper. I found the most fun in the chaos of building multiple settlements at once, jumping around to different areas, but even then it feels a bit out of crawl as the giants move at a snail's pace. And the cooldowns, especially when you're focused on one spot at a time, feels just a bit too slow. Ultimately, there's no hook to keep you going. The game doesn't do enough to keep itself from feeling painfully repetitive after your first few experiences with it. That being said, if you're a math fan, Rias will offer a decent amount of fun and great challenge. I give Rias a 7 out of 10. If you played Rias, tell me what you thought about it down in the comment section below. If you haven't played it, tell me if you plan on picking it up. Thumbs up. If you like the video, subscribe if you're new to the channel. And tune in Monday for first impressions where you find out what game we're playing next. Thanks for watching.